There's nothing more that I need for my soul right now than a holiday. However, there's nothing further from what I need in terms of like business and YouTube than a holiday. Than a holiday. <laughs> <laughs> so long story short, if you guys followed me on Instagram, you would have known that last week was awesome. The worst. I had a great week. I had the worst week of my life. I had like a breakdown because Kurt has been traveling so much and I was here and it was really tough by myself. I'm sorry. I'm so behind. <laughs> but this trip is for my birthday. So Kurt was going to get me like these runners and then he was asking, do I want like jewelry? And I was like, I just don't need anything. Like I don't want anything materialistic. I want to go on our first family holiday. How much does our life change? Vlogging while folding, folding baby clothes. <laughs> Welcome to Sarah's day. Here's folding my, day. Here's my predicament. So we're going to Byron Bay. Normally it's like beautiful and sunny and Kurt checked the weather. Torrential rain the whole time we're going to be there. And Fox won't have his jolly job. Oh, what fun for him to do? My Pretty. apartment right now is disgusting. Messy. It's clean, but it's messy. Feng Shui, it's all rainbow. Like, are you put, look at this. <laughs> this is sitting next to my dining room. What Most the heck is this? expensive piece of plastic overboard. Oh my <laughs> we bought this. The Disney puzzle. If it's going to rain for four days, what do we pack Fox? Like, what? I don't know. But he sleeps in these. It's like a sleeping gag. <laughs> but we need to bring like 50 of them because he pees on them all. My closing note of this folding situation, because I'm sure this is really riveting for you to watch. Kurt took it upon himself to organize the whole thing, which is amazing because I'm normally the organizer in our life. So when it comes to my birthday, I just put my hands in the air. Like I just don't care. I'm not doing anything. You do it all. And I made the foolish decision to ask what time is our flight tomorrow? Our flight is at 7 a.m. We live an hour away from the airport. I breastfeed. I have to get a baby ready. I have to get myself ready. We're gonna have to wake up. Like I feed Fox at 3 a.m. because he just wakes up for a feed. I may as well just stay up. Like I may as well just stay up. No, no, no. You, well, you I'm gonna guess. go to bed for one hour then get up again and we go. <sighs> I don't know, it might, it might work out as planned. But I'm excited to take him on a plane because I feel like he's gonna, feel like he's gonna love it. Yeah. I just know I'm going to try to feed him on the way up to try to equalize his ears. Funny thing about this, this flight, is that he's actually going to fly business class for the first time. What? <laughs> <laughs> You're so stupid! It's what? an hour flight, but I thought, why not? One thing you need to know about Kurt is he's so extra. You guys think, oh, says he's so high maintenance. No! No, I'm chill as. It's like domestic business. I thought, oh, why don't I just tell you now? Because like, you're gonna get to the airport, you're gonna know anyway. Well, I'm really excited. <laughs> I'm really excited. Who cares if it rains every day? We're flying business. <laughs> Woo. Foxy is up from his nap. Your first airplane ever. And you get to go business. <laughs> yeah. And I'm always conscious. Like I never want to spam you guys with like, Fox cam. You know those people who just like post like 20 photos of their baby and you're like, I get it, your baby's cute. I don't want to be that person. But then people say I haven't been showing him enough on my vlogs and they want to see more of him. Wow, look at that. That's fabulous. Yeah, do you like being up there? King of the castle. Mr. Fox. Ruler of the land. The amount of space a baby takes up. Like we're full on taking his baby seat. Are you really bringing this? Yeah, he loves that. Okay, 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 okay. So for the past like hour, no, like 20 minutes, I've just been trying on clothes because when I pack, I try to be like tactical. Everything I bring, I want to actually wear. So I've got like jumpers, two pairs of jeans, some hoodies, my skincare cupboard, which once was beautiful and organized, but I had a baby, so there's that. So I need to prioritize what I'm gonna bring from that cupboard because I do like to bring some face masks and stuff and like pamper myself when I'm away. Okay, it's like 10 p.m. and I'm almost finished packing, but I just wanted to show you my toiletry bag, but I pack mostly skincare stuff. Like this is everything I'm bringing. So I'm bringing things like my jade roller. I love, love this sleep on mask. This one's from Origins, obsessed with it. Got my cleanser, got this deodorant that I'm sampling, the skin oils my spin brush, stuff like that. I'm literally bringing one, two, three, five products. I have mascara, foundation, bronzer, highlighter, which I probably won't even use, 
and blush and on most days I'll probably just wear mascara like today okay I'll dishevelled today but I just have mascara on well I'm gonna be up in like one hour feeding Fox and then up in like another three hours feeding Fox and then I'll have maybe like a one hour power nap and then I'll be getting ready for the airport but I'm really really excited What a kerfuffle. Hi, Fox. Signed in a cool big and a cool star. Okay, so we're still slow. Yeah, I know. So slow. We're running late and Daddy's stressed. So a bit of a hectic morning, but we made it. We're in the business lounge. Just. So bougie. I got a little coffee. It's a little bit burnt, but that's okay. I actually put on that sleep on mask underneath my foundation this morning because it's like super hydrating. So I'm hoping that I won't be like really dry when I get off the plane. Little foxinator. Yep. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Yeah, 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 yeah. You. Let's get situated. He wants to feed now. Gotta wait for takeoff. Where are we? He's looking out the window. <laughs> we're at desperate attempts trying to keep Fox quiet. We want Sarah to be feeding while we're in like the lift off so his ears can like pressurize. Is that the right word? Equalize, that's it. Oh, he's real. Oh no. <laughs> It's so weird traveling with a baby. Like, I still feel like we're just teens. Walking around holding a baby, like, I still feel like he's not mine. Do you know what I mean? Like, yeah. we're a family. How weird is that? We're on a family holiday. <laughs> what? We were outside and it's Quite kind of warm. I didn't bring any warm clothes. I brought like four jumpers and jeans. That's Sarah's it. just packed for, for Sydney weather and that's it. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. So let's make this apartment tour it's quick. It's just fun to be in a resort. I am opening Ooh. the door right now. Ooh, very nice. Okay, the last two times we've come, we've been in a one better because it's just Kurt and I. But this is like family style. Yeah, look cribs. At, welcome wow. to my crib, crib, crib. Look at your bed, Fox. This is your bed. Whoa. Oh, this one's nicer oh, than the ones whoa. we've stayed in before. We're gonna move Fox's crib to the bathroom. Oh, this is massive. This is Full kids here. This would be sick. This would be this is Look, perfect. You're so lucky. Look at this. Look, your daddy loves you so much. Can this be a yearly holiday? Is yes. That, is yes. that too extra? No. This is where we're gonna put our puzzle. <laughs> no, this is where we sit out here. We read a book. You don't have a you don't read. You've been so patient. I'm gonna give you a milkshake. <laughs> Shake it up. Yeah. But seriously, I am gonna feed him now, so see ya. <laughs>
suit. And we'll go it. to like the pool slash spa. I hope we can get there before it rains. It is actually still winter in Australia, but here we're like a bit more north, but I think it might be too cold for him in the pool. We might just put him in the spa. Got this one? This one looks perfect. Locked and loaded. Oh my gosh, Fox, look at you go. Oh, he floats. <laughs> He's squishing against my face. Having a good time there, you, mate? Are you comfortable <laughs> laying on my nose? Looking good there, sir. Ow. Ow. <laughs> Someone's a bit needy. He's so tired today. Yeah, he's a bit tired. Normally he only has the dummy to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Do you like that one? <gasps> oh, hello. Oh. <laughs> I know you can hear me. Are you ignoring me? <laughs> yeah. What is this new scream of his? You guys, I'm an actual idiot. I feel like I'm one end of the spectrum or the other. I either pack way too much that I never wear anything in my suitcase or like now I did not pack anything. There's currently a little bit of sunshine outside and I checked the weather and it said it was gonna be <laughs> it said it was gonna be like rainy and freezing cold every single day. So literally all I brought was like this knit, this knit, this knit and this jumper. So I'm going to the beach Ah! And yes, it is my birthday today. Happy birthday to me! Happy birthday! Thank you. Wow, how's this for a beach outfit? Terrible. Absolutely terrible. Yeah, I'm in a food coma right now because we went to this restaurant called Treehouse and it's like gluten-free pizzas and nachos and stuff like that. Wow, even the waiters were like looking at us because of how much we ordered. Yeah, we ordered two pizzas and nachos. And like, they're large pretty meals. Pretty decent size. And yeah. we pretty much finished it all. Like, it was so yummy and I'm no regrets because every now and then I, I want to go out to dinner and I want to have like the gluten-free pizza and stuff like that, that's like not necessarily healthy. It's good because it reminds me of why I eat healthy. Like I just feel a bit like, yeah. And that's what I mean, like I eat healthy because it makes me feel good because I don't like feeling like this. So tonight for birthday dinner, I don't even care. Like we could just get room service, I'm chill. When we came back from the pool, he was a big hit in the foyer. Yeah. Everyone was stopping like being like, what, he's in a baby wetsuit? That's the coolest thing ever. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, do I need a, should we bring a jumper? Maybe, maybe. Maybe I'll just, place. I'll grab a jumper. This oh. weather is so confusing. Wait, that's not my jumper. This is my jumper. It looks so warm. Oh, it's actually cold. I ate too much pizza last night. Just loving it. I was just in the moment. And like, you know, when you're talking and eating, I just wasn't mindful eating. I just couldn't stop. <laughs> Someone has a huge tummy ache today, but I kind of don't regret it. I need to do a big pizza poo, you know what I mean? After a huge meal, you feel better. I'm just waiting for it, anticipating it, looking forward to it. Someday I'll find a home The picture in my mind A place where I can go and you The sun is out. out, it's my birthday, the guns I have are coffee, out. Fox has a fabulous hat on, couldn't get any better. Look and fly. Crushing it. Oh. They're paper, paper cups, no plastic at all. Compostable How at home. How impossible is that? <laughs> well, that weather changed rather quickly. <laughs> yeah, she's no longer blue skies and sun. I'm thinking. I'm thinking, go into town, get a smoothie bowl, I'm chill. We're all having some breakfast right now. Cool. <laughs> Besides us. Besides us. <laughs> Birthday feed, we're out the front of where we think we're gonna get some smoothie bowls. left you guys like six hours ago I don't know in that time frame we went to the pool went to the spa went for a drive it's just been a really nice chill birthday and it's mostly been revolved around Fox obviously yeah. but I don't really care like I just want to be chill like I am this bird if you're an OG subscriber you know I hate birds <laughs> <laughs> at my old house like at my parents house my parents loved the birds and it was like tranquil to them. Hated it, couldn't sleep. Anyway, I digress. We've started playing. 
And then Fox fell asleep. So we're kind of bound to the cabin. We were gonna train. Well, we feel well, like you weren't very keen today. I wasn't. I wasn't in the was, mood to work out. Keen. We looked around the cabin for some fun games. We found dominoes. I'm not really into it. And <laughs> I love drawing. Like, I'm not a good drawer. I just like to draw for fun. This bird. We're playing this game called Mr. Squiggle. You get a blank piece of paper. You draw a squiggle. You give it to the other person. And they have to make a drawing out of it. So we've been playing this for like... A solid half an hour and we've got a person. If you're bored and you only have like a pad of paper and a pencil and two people, this is what me and my sisters used to do for hours. Oh! oh. <laughs> Let's do a Mr. Squiggle. Kurt draws me these dumb squiggles that are like so hard to make. Do be real, be real. No, you did the last no. one that was so... Okay, okay, okay. Let's be okay, real together. Okay. okay. A solid really squiggle. big squiggle. No, bit. no, don't. No, yeah, I'm okay. gonna do it all right one. Okay. <laughs> Please, I want to have a fun time. Right, okay, we're going to have fun time. It's going to be a fun time. I want to have fun. It's going to be a fun time. <laughs> Are you having fun? I'm having so much fun. Okay, don't. Ooh, I love going on holidays <laughs> with you and Fox. <laughs> the first step is draw a squiggle, a nice squiggle. Actually, please. I will. Oh, I'm drawing will. you a good one. I'm drawing you a good one. So I'm drawing Kurt. Don't, Kurt. <laughs> Cat, no, no, yes. no. <laughs> this doesn't mean anything right now. No. That is a cactus no. with boulders next no. to it. <laughs> no, Kurt. Kurt. She's such a party pooper. No, Comment I, below if she's a party no, pooper. No, no, do you know what? I have young viewers and I'm not going to put that kind of squiggle in their face. You ruin the game. <laughs> a little aggressive down the bottom. You always and you've got to be quick. No, no. Because slow. No, you always do crap squiggles. Are you like, joking? She's the worst at squiggles. She doesn't do anything that's helpful ever. What do you mean? They're always rubbish squiggles. You are you rubbish. You're you just a rubbish any... drawer. No, you are. You can't think abstractly. No. Don't you know that's a skill? You are not a good squiggle drawer. You are not a nice person. <laughs> <laughs> I'm nearly done. No, you're not. Yeah, I am. No. How would you spell the word? Spit. Yes. Like, how would you spell? <laughs> yeah. P-S-H. Fox is up from his last nap of the day. Jim man. I spit on you, I'm a camel. Um, I don't really want to get out of my robe. <laughs> All right, let's just get room service. Okay, we just ordered room service and we got, this is like a mini mukbang. I've never done one before and I'm not really going to, but tuna sushi with jalapenos. Oh my gosh, I'm ruining it. Fun, love sushi. I ordered us, what did I get us? Chicken laksa, like a fried rice thing. I feel like I didn't film actually much of my birthday, but it's mostly just because I wanted to be in the moment, you know what I mean? But right now, we're about to head home. We're gonna go get breakfast in the foyer first. Yeah, we're gonna go get all-you-can-eat buffet, feel full of food. <laughs> every time I travel, every time we go away, I just, it's a food frenzy! <laughs> and I'm just... Little guy, look at how cool he is. He had the best trip. He had so much fun. Alright, see you back in Sydney. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh.